Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com doing a 10 buck break of Goodwin Champions. It's right here, 2017. It's a one box break of Upper Deck Goodwin Champions. And it's a random pack break. So there's 20 packs in here, but we only sold 10 spots. Which means we have to, uh, double up, uh, uh. Sir mix a lot this list right here. And there's packs one through 20. So we'll randomize your names. We'll randomize the numbers. So let's pop this open first and let's number the packs. Oh, see, there you go, Callum. Yeah, I was, we should do that once a week. I think that's a good amount of time. And then you could get into that prism. All right. So this is from 10buckbreaks.com, breaking here on the main channel. That is a one, trust me on that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, 16. I know this is pretty exciting, huh? So <laughs> makes for a good show. 19, 20. If you're re-watching this on YouTube, you can always fast forward through this part. I'm, there is absolutely zero entertainment there while I'm numbering packs. Okay, so now that all the packs are numbered, let's uh, randomize each list five times, one out of four, five times. One, two, three, four, and five. We got Coop with Last Spot Mojo on top and a couple Coops on the bottom. And then once again, one out of four, five times for the numbers, the pack numbers. One, two, three, four, and five. <laughs> yeah, there might be Coopers like, yeah, waiting for the YouTube compilation compilation of the best of Joe numbering packs. There, I'm sure there's some moments where I had to number a lot of packs and we goofed around, but really, at the end of the day, the most important thing is what comes out of these packs. And this is what these people here are waiting for. Coop with one, 13, two right here. So I'm not going to read these. You guys can read on the screen, right? Coop's got a lot of packs. Everyone else has got some packs too. I think that's what it turns out to be. Uh, let's just keep track of Coop. Uh, Last Spot Mojo, 17. We'll also break these alphabetically. So Coop still has 17 right there. Awesome. So Dave, we're going to do your packs first. Let me get a couple uh, blank cards here. There we go. I think there should be... We have Wood, Dave, Jeff, and Coop. Perfect. All right. So Big Boys, 007. We're going to go with you first. You have packs 13 and 7. 007 has 7. 13 and 7. So there's 7 right here. There's 13 hiding right here. Let's move these over. All right, pack 7. So there are three hits in here. Grab the box out of the trash can. There's three hits here, right? So, I, so we're, we're looking for some. Uh, some crazy stuff. So let's see what we got. All right, first one, we have Stephen King with a guitar, which I always thought was weird. Uh, there's nothing that says music here, but yet there he is with a guitar. I don't understand. I don't understand that. There's the panda, the mighty panda, who nature wants to eliminate, right? Like they don't want to eat. They're very picky eaters, right? And they don't want to eat and they don't want to mate. Yet, we're trying to keep him. I don't know. I mean, I think at some point, just got to let it go, world. Tiger Woods Mini. We've got a couple other, a few other people here. Nice. On the next side, we've got Chrissy Blair, a model. Memorabilia. Nice. Giraffe and Al Franken, comedian. 
turned politician. Pretty decent one at that. As far as former comedians becoming politicians go. All right, so there you go. Dave, those are your two packs. Let me write these down. So today is the 24th. That was for Big Boys 007. That was packs 13 and 7. Goodwin Champions number 16. All right, going in alphabetical order. Right here, we've got Jeffrey. Uh, Jeffrey, 16, 6, 16, and 6. Ten and fourteen. Ten and fourteen. Coop, you have the rest. Stack all these up. So good luck, Jeffrey. We've got, nice, World Traveler. What is this? Oh, a map of Cartagena, Colombia. Oh, nice. Looks beautiful. I want to go there. All right, so that's considered a hit right there, Jeffrey. Nice. Some of these are, are pretty short printed, so you'd be surprised at how much they would go for. There's the lion, Roar, Martin Van Buren. He is probably has the best sidebirds of any president. There's Ben Simmons. And there's Michael Jordan right here. I'm sure, I wonder if that Ben Simmons has some sort of value. We'll sleeve that up anyway. There you go, Jeffrey, nice. Right. That's what I use these blank cards for. I can write people's info right here. Keeps things organized. Sixteen, six, ten, and fourteen. Keeps things organized there. All right, Scott. Cooper, Coop, you have the rest. Good luck. So we saw two hits. There should be a third hiding in there somewhere. Yeah, these are pretty goofy cards, Callum. Yeah, as TJ was saying, this is like, this is Upper Deck's version of, uh, of uh, Alan and Ginter. Both, actually, I'm pretty sure that both Alan, the Allen & Ginter brand and the Goodwin Champions brand were both uh, old tobacco companies from the 1800s, I believe. And they just bought up the, uh, they just bought up the brands. A lot of the, uh, a lot of the old tobacco companies released cards that were like this. And if you get like, if you get one of the uh, short prints here, then um, you know a lot of those could go for hundreds of dollars. Do you know why, Nick S? Why Cooper would spend more than a hundred bucks on this? Because of Tiger Woods autographs in here, Michael Jordan autographs in here, Ben Simmons autographs in here. That's why it's worth it. Guess what? Michael Jordan is exclusive to Upper Deck. Ben Simmons, exclusive to Upper Deck. Tiger Woods, exclusive to Upper Deck. Ben Simmons, exclusive to Upper Deck. So, Coop looks pretty clever now. Because he's like, I'm only going to spend a little bit for a lot of that. Which is what really what we're, is what we're looking for. And you just get goofy stuff like this Rhino. <laughs> right, you want to handle one of one in there too. Hey, if you get a one-of-one one panda, 
That'll actually probably go for a lot. A lot of people build sets of these too, so. A lot of people collect those minis. There's a panda. That's a different variation on that panda. Set that Ben Simmons aside too. Nice Genie Bouchard's in there. Yeah, get that zebra graded, Coop. I would collect all the animal cards. Get them graded. You'd have the foremost Goodwin Champions animal set. See, just collect all these animals together. And you get this uh, lenticular right here. Whoa. It's pretty trippy right there. Ooh. The Triangulum Galaxy. Man. Contains about 40 billion stars. We should get Neil Tyson to cross over. Just come on in. Three million light years from Earth in the constellation Triangulum. 60,000 light years away. It's a, it's a ways away. It's a ways away. Some more animals. And looks like that is that. So there you go, folks. That was a one box break, random pack break of 2017 Upper Deck Goodwin Champions number 16. From 10bugbreaks.com, recording live here at Redondo Beach, jazbeeshobbyland.com. Thanks very much, everyone. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.